The Phalanx Close in Weapons System, or CWIZ, is designed to cover a specific area with a high rate of fire and ammunition, as well dropping or destroying enemy fire from the sky before it can reach the ship. The CWIZ can fire up to 4,500 rounds per minute. This weapon is intended to defend against approaching enemy attacks, including missiles, small arms fire, drones, hostile aircraft, and small ships. It works as a component of a comprehensive, multi-layered defensive system to thwart attacks in the immediate area. The weapon is now installed aboard a variety of Navy ships, including cruisers, destroyers, aircraft carriers, and amphibious assault ships. Upgrades are intended to significantly boost capabilities and guarantee system viability in the face of a constantly shifting and more complicated threat environment. The latest refurbishment included several improvements to the weapon itself, converting the current system to the so-called Phalanx 1B version. The Phalanx Seawiz Block IB Baseline 2 Radar is a next-generation radar for the system that is currently being developed and integrated, according to Navy authorities. The Block 1B design adds an integrated forward-looking infrared FLIR, sensor to enable defense against asymmetrical threats such swift small surface ships, slow-flying fixed and rotary wing aircraft, and unmanned aerial vehicles. OGB and ELC work together to boost first strike range and create tighter dispersion. The enhanced lethality cartridge of the Phalanx 1B's MK-244 ammunition is specifically engineered to pierce anti-ship cruise missiles. General Dynamics Ordnance and Tactical Systems claims that the MK-244 ammunition is designed with an aluminum nose piece and a 48% heavier tungsten penetrator. The Phalanx Block IB Baseline 2 Radar Update is a new digital radar that offers better detection capability, enhanced dependability, and shorter working hours for system maintenance for sailors. By integrating commercial off-the-shelf, COTS, signal processing together with a new signal source and mixer, the Baseline 2 update, according to Navy officials, decreases the amount of outdated components present in existing analog radars. Additionally, Radar Baseline 2 gives SeaWiz access to a surface mode, which makes it possible to monitor, identify, and subsequently eliminate threats that are closer to the water's surface than with earlier weapon designs. The improved Phalanx SeaWiz is intended to enable ships to deal with surface threats they have never encountered before. Block IB Baseline 2 radar upgrade kits cost an average of $931,000 per unit, whereas upgrades and conversions of previous Phalanx SeaWiz systems to Phalanx Block IB cost about $4.5 million per unit. The Phalanx Block IB configuration includes an enhanced lethality cartridge, an optimized gun barrel OBG, an auto acquisition video tracker, and a reliable infrared forward-looking sensor, ELC. According to Navy authorities, the Block IB gives the ship more defensive capabilities against asymmetrical threats including unmanned aerial vehicles, tiny, fast-moving surface ships, and slow-flying fixed and rotary wing aircraft. FLIR also enhances performance against anti-ship cruise missiles by giving the fire control computer more precise angle tracking data.